Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Hype Train here on Past Teachers Again, I know it's been a while, I know you actually were expecting to see Convy sitting down next to me for another one of these, but uh, yeah, he's not going to be here for all of them, so um, you're going to get more talky, more kind of like uh, elaboration on what I see through the video, possibly with me jumping back and forth, less than a back and forth between me and him, so back and forth between me and the trailers instead, and today we're looking at Cars 3, the official US trailer. I am not excited to see this, but it's a Disney Pixar film, and I'm shocked that this series has managed to get as far as three movies. Let's just see what they got to show us. Brand in racing. Movie deals, infomercials, product endorsements. You think you're famous now? <laughs> we'll be rich beyond belief. Mr. Sterling, what is this about? Your legacy. Every time you lose, you damage yourself. I'm sorry. Your racing days are coming to an end. So, I can only hope that this race today wasn't his last. I decide when I'm done. How you feeling? I can't go out on the track and do the same old thing. It won't work. It's futile to resist change, man. You know what I'd do? What? I don't know. I got nothing. I am so excited to train you. I like a challenge. <laughs> I call you my senior project. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! Huh? The beach ate me. Jackson Storm set a new record today when he pulled off the fastest lap ever recorded. Hey, have you seen the latest record Storm's been setting? Have you given any thought to retire? The queen. This is my last chance, Cruz. Last. If I lose, I never get to do this again. <laughs> Fear failure. Be afraid of not having the chance. You have the chance. I used to watch you on TV. Flying through the air. You seemed so fearless. I wish I knew what that felt like. Uh. You'll never be as fast as Storm, but you can be smarter than him. The racing is the reward, not the stuff. Storm's chances of winning are 95.2%. So going for a full kind of redemption story on him, right? Um, yeah. Let, let's just play that back over again while I actually talk about it for a couple of minutes. Now, Lightning McQueen as a character hasn't really been that interesting. Uh, but essentially, what I have a feeling about is that they've said you tried to do a Rocky thing with this. You know, his uh, rise, his success, continued success. A sideline story where he's actually speed racer while everything's worrying about the fucking truck. And then finally now a story that's kind of like, he's reached his peak, he's dropped again and returned. Now, the animation in this doesn't look as good as the animation in the original trailer. They, where they went hyper real, like they went uh, unnecessarily realistic for the actual... Um, for the vehicles and the crash. I mean, well, this is actually looks like it's not that it's been tunified, but it looks like it's been the focus has been changed rather than actually it's about Lightning McQueen. It's actually about his, his injury and him recovering back from it rather than actually showing just a really good car crash, which was good because I mean you, you still have to keep it in within that realm of uncanny value to actually not have kids sitting there going, "Yay, exploding car crashes!" Um, with the main characters that have been shown in this, the new characters shown in this, it looks like another Pixar money spinning hit especially for kids who are big fans of the car series um i'm not being a massive fan of the cars playing series but i like the world that it's in it's kind of funny um middle i've probably seen more of the little kind of like mini tales that came along after the films than the actual films themselves i've seen all three of them of its art yeah planes cars one cars two planes i've seen all those at some point and i didn't find them offensive but I found them to be really, really the bottom barrel of quality whenever it comes to Pixar animated features. Maybe it's just something that I don't identify with the figures and the cars. I love Kit. I love the talking car idea. It's just, 
I don't know, NASCAR doesn't do it for me. Um, the character said she being a lone gunslinger in a car driving world. Um, I'm just not in, I'm just not into the series, but this looks like a decent film. Its arc looks like it actually has a pace to go. It has enough emotional build and has me smirking enough times during the trailer alone just to have me involved and interested. So yeah, guys, that was the Disney Pixar's Cars 3 trailer, the official US trailer. It's actually been released. I think it was a probably uh, near enough a week ago it came out, but I'm only getting around to it now. So guys, yeah. Eh, cars <laughs> it's going to print its own money um looking forward to see i'm actually looking forward to kind of hear my nieces and nephews talking about this this movie because it'll it'll revitalize a film that they grew up with um and hopefully they'll be interested in seeing in, in <laughs> the incredibles whenever that one revives my nostalgia for uh earlier pixar movies so guys thank you very much for watching this has been hype train and we've been uh, talking about Cars 3. If you enjoy me just kind of rambling over the top of the trailers, you can, of course, always hit the subscribe button up there. And if you're hitting one of the buttons over here, one of them will actually show you a list of trailers and other things we've done as part of Hype Train. You can also see a playlist of uh, other videos that are played here on the channel, most recent uploads, and one specially selected just for you to make sure that you actually find the stuff that you want to find here on Passage of Skin. If you like those, make sure to subscribe and also give it in touch or any other things on the bottom here. There are all ways of actually getting a hold of me. Just Google Passage of Skin, you'll find me. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Now, I'll see all you dudes in the next trailer. Bye.